It is a temptation of some, in their desponding state, to think that they have committed the sin against the Holy Ghost. We have known Christians, with piety which nobody doubted but themselves, who have been at times exceedingly distressed, with the apprehension that they were guilty of this unpardonable sin. Since the Reformation, a more common opinion has been that it was the sin of the Jews when they ascribed the miracles of Christ to the agency of Satan. Dr. Chalmers and others think it to be not so much any one sin against the Holy Ghost as a prolonged sinning, a resisting and grieving the Heavenly Comforter until he ceases to strive and withdraws. Conviction of sin, regeneration, sanctification are no longer possible because the dishonored spirit, so often repelled, has let these impenitent persons alone. Sinning now has become unpardonable, as it can no longer be repented of. 